Alright, welcome back everyone. This is Dragon in White here and we are back with one about uh, well, not one final, but I was about to say one final, but yeah, uh, for another episode of Assassin's Creed and this is the final episode of this uh, recording session. This is the fourth in a row. I tend to do it in fourth because uh you know it's an easy number for me to deal with. Uh, and yeah, let's continue on with the main story. Let me see what's the fastest way to my next uh thing. Okay, to the frontier. And I just realized I actually could do this, and this actually makes things a lot easier. So this brings me back home here. So fast travel. So I think maybe it might be worth trying to unlock as many fast travels as I can. Oops. Okay, and you know that will you know make things easy for me for traveling around. I'm guessing the old man is all the way behind here. It is done. Johnson is dead? No. He retreated when we destroyed the team. Only to hatch some new scheme, I'm sure. You should have killed him. There was no need. Time will tell if you speak the truth. Kind of sad. Radun Hagedum! Radun Hagedum! Oh, he's going to regret his decision. Why are you here? Has something happened? William Johnson has returned with all the money required to buy our land. He meets with the elders as we speak. I have begged him to resist, but... I fear he shall have his way, unless you intervene. How is this possible? We destroyed the tea. The Templars are nothing if not resourceful. You should have heeded my warning. Please, you have to stop him. Of course. Can and you tell me where they're meeting? Kill him. Okay, and before we continue, I'm gonna pause here for a quick moment. I should have done this before I started recording this episode, but I need to you know, take a quick toilet break. I'll be back before you know it. I mean, since this is YouTube, you know, you guys will barely notice anytime. All right. Okay, and we are back. Um, Not that you guys will notice a difference, but uh, yeah, let us continue with the main story. We are back here. What do we have here? Lots of homestead missions, which is, I think, a good thing. Too bad I can't, you know, quick teleport to those area. Uh, I really would love to be able to do that. Okay, first let's do a bit of uh, simple housekeeping. I think to, I think today's episode will be focused on homestead missions that will bring us a bit more cash, I believe. And uh, yeah. Okay, let's see what can we craft. Hmm. Franklin stove, iron ore. I think firstly we need to buy all the resources we can, right? So. Okay, I think I pretty much bought everything I could already. Okay, there we go. Now let's see what can I get. Need growth root lumber. Oak lumber, pine lumber.
Can I make nothing? Well, it appears I can make nothing because I don't have enough ingredients. So, let's see. I got two convoy. Let's try to sell some things that I have. This way. Okay, let's see. Beaver pelt should be worth it. Wait, wait, excess plus 500. That's his deer pelt. No. If only there's a way for me to sort out by what is the most valuable. Okay, let's try wolf pelt. It's not bad. You know what? You know what? Let's just do it. Set the second convoy, select resource. I think it was beaver pelt seems to be the most worth it, right? Yeah, plus 500. And that lets me 1,500. Okay, so we'll have to monitor the uh, convoy because they do get attacked. And if they get attacked, I lose the convoy. And my goods, which is rather problematic. Okay. Get to them first. The colors in the remastered actually look pretty nice. Uh, the scenery is nice. I, I I remember. I'm not sure it was was it whether was it like that previously, but it looks really awesome. Unfortunately, it's kind of straining on the graphic card. Thank God you are here. Prudence is missing. She went out to gather some things this morning and never returned. I'm worried sick. What if she's hurt? I will find her. The dog might help track her down. He has a good nose. Come on, boy! He has been gathering the evening primrose almost every night. She is obsessed with the oil it yields. That is all going to stop now. I don't understand why she wants so damn much of the stuff. Mm, money? I mean, I'm pretty sure oil sells for a lot. She picked some here. She can't be far. We should split up to cover more ground. Hmm. 
flower back. Oh, it's the wolf or oh, no the bear. Have a bear? Let me have a bear, please. Thank you so much, Connor. Thank you. I don't want to think what might have happened if you had not arrived. I saw some primrose growing there, and the bear just came charging at me. Why are you gathering primrose? Yama. Well, Warren and I have been trying to conceive a child for a long time now. I read that evening primrose encourages fertility. <laughs> I'm sorry, <laughs> this is not a proper conversation given the circumstance. I understand. Not another word on the matter. Connor, anything yet? Prudence! Are you all right, my love? I'll be fine. Thanks to Connor. Thank you, Connor. Once again. And now they can produce level 2 goods, which is good. And the stuff which I need. And more on here. Let's uh, you know, talk to him first. Interactive conversation. I'm not even sure whether if that is even important or not. Hello, Connor. Hello. Is something the matter? No, nothing that need worry you. I would not pry, but please know that if there was anything I could do to help, I would. It's all right. Connor already knows half of it. As you know, we've been trying to have a child, Connor, for a long time. Thus far, we have not been blessed even once. It takes its toll after a time. You must not force such things. Nature will grant you with the young one when the time is right. We hope you're right, Connor. At the very least, we are at peace here. Okay. Let's see, homestead mission. I'm actually more interested in the one that gives me level 2 ores. I suspect that's the thing that's going to give me silver ore. This tree is blocking me at that it's really irritating. Hunter. Could you make a little more noise? They're fixing to trap a cougar I've seen prowling about. The beast has snapped two of my snares already. From what I've seen, its fur is white, mad as it sounds. Its hide would be worth a fortune to the right person. I have never seen a cougar like that. I would like to help you. I'll follow you then. Stay. Got his trail yet? Yep. See, you're talking to a Native American here. One that is an expert at tracking and hunting. Better shoot true. Should I'll take it down with a knife. He's a taste for fresh meat. Seen this before. Looks fresh. He's close. There he goes! We won't get another chance at this. 
Come on, Connor. We won't see him again after this. This is our only shot. Hurry up. Chase, chase. You must be here for my new friend. I was dumping a load and he went straight in. Lucky I wasn't in there. Very. What are you thinking, Miriam? Flush and fire. Norris can back off. One of us goes in there to draw him out, and the other waits out here to shoot. Ah, so much for your I will knife go in. to stab him. She looks very happy. <laughs> What's that? Google nice vision. shot! Thank you, Miriam. Pretty sure I could have taken that on my own, but okay, sure. Take credit for it. What? It sent me all the way to the top. That's irritating. Fortunately, the homestead area is small enough that uh, fast travel is not a, a big issue normally. Why do you shout? Jump him! You know, sneak up on him and BAM! There he goes. the trouble Connor so you tear past chasing a man he was trying to rob your home it has been dealt with what oh, the women is everyone all right you should have been there what I told you to head back I didn't I need you since when is a skinny runt like you safe out in the bush alone if Diana's here I swear you'll be the one Well, there we go, Lumberus. Well, I don't have too much time left for today's episode. So, oh, okay, wait, you know what? I still can do this again. Let's go do. I thought I could go to the frontier to, you know, pick up some of the miscellaneous things that, um, you know, not very compulsory kind of thing. The optional quests, you know, pack leg items, the grindy bits, you know. Well, since I got this, 
I mean, I know these are optional and stuff like that as well, but uh, it's good to have all this done and just to make sure. Wait. Land convoy. Okay, they're all good. Because of the earlier incident, sure. Oh, good. Okay, my convoy has arrived. That gives me more money. I told you, I didn't need your help. Oh, if you'd listen. What do I do with this? Come on, escape, Grace. Oh, okay. Hold them together. You need some sense knocked into you. I'm gonna smash you, you looby. You need some sense knocked into you. I'm going to beat you senseless. I'm going to smash you, you looby. You got what was coming to you. There we go. A bit of explanation would have been nice. Ensure that fight never happens again. You know what's the easiest way to do that? Kill one of them. <laughs> I suppose, you know, to talk to them. You all right? There's no need for this. Yeah, he's a blockhead. Don't kill off in a spell. Just need some time is all. Talk to the other dude. Are you not angry, Godfrey? Me? <laughs> not at all. Terry's just got himself a temper, and I won't let him get away with it. It's really no trouble. He'll calm down. The runt couldn't do much damage anyway. Does this happen often? Ha! Ah. I was just telling Lance how I can set that calendar by these events. It's really not a worry, Connor, but I appreciate your concern. Okay, if you say so. Level three good, please. It feels like everything that can be done is done. I do have a little bit more time, do I? Yes. Let's see what I can do with regards to the ship. And uh, I forgot I wanted to uh, send out the convoy once more, perhaps. I 
be a good idea. Let's see what we have here first. How reinforcement, don't care about that. Cannons. Actually, it's the grip shot which I really want. Nope. Honestly, don't really care. Not for this too. Okay, let's see what I can do here. Really not much I can do on this one. But I suppose uh, a bit of extra cash would be good set them to go to Boston and then what I could do also is to uh, you know complete some of the minor stuff in Boston okay let's see what we can get from trading first not trading um, yep from this one It'll be good to just buy everything I can. Kind of wish there's a buy all button. Rosemary, rosemary is very useful for cooking that is. Beaver pelt earns me a lot of money. Okay, good. So let's see what I can craft now. I need to level up the artisan. Poultry meat machines and you kill chicken. Oh, this is bait. Actually, I didn't really care for this one here. This is the one I want. Okay, I can't do this and I need level 3 blacksmith. Oh, convoy, good. Okay, first let's have a basic 3 convoy. And then let's see if we can upgrade one. And we need more pine lumber. Okay, as it is, there's only one thing we can make, which is barrels. Oh, I don't want this. Oh, I but the tailor can't do it yet. Okay, so let's try to make two barrels and see what we can get off it. Okay, select convoy. Craft the items. Ah. Uh, not really worth it. I wish they do show me the price, but as far as what I do know, Hunting gives me the best so far. So, you know, I'm just going to send as much as I can. Um, hunting. No, wait, hunting. Dang it! Keep getting the wrong number. Select convoy. Okay. 
There we go, and I should make quite a lot of money off this. Uh, now let's go back to hunting, restock, restock. Okay, and I think given this, I think we have reached the end of what we have time for. I uh, will probably, you know, AFK, uh, not say AFK, I will probably uh, do some off camera money earning using the convoys and maybe hunting a little. But as far as it goes, that's the end of today's episode. And here's my usual shameless plugs. You know, check out Immortal and Martial Duel Cultivation. Um, it's free to read at hostednovel.com. Do check out the link in the description below. And also, if you'd like to support me for what I do, I have a Patreon set up and you can support me there. Um, no, I mean, financially, if, that is, if you want to do that. There's no obligation. Only if you want to. But, uh, you know, I get to do what I uh, what I do, the translation and the YouTube because of, you know, uh, generous supporters like the Patreon supporters. Uh, if you'd like to do that, you know, the link is down in the description below. You can do that for either the YouTubes or the um, translation. Both works. And uh, next up is the Dragon and Ride merch store. Uh, I mean, honestly, I didn't get much of this and there's barely any sales. But, you know, it's still up there and I do enjoy some of the... I, I buy some of them for myself too and I, I do quite like them especially the t-shirt and the hoodie uh, they are quite good quality in my opinion especially those from the American apparel brand uh, albeit slightly more pricey but good stuff and uh, I've really been enjoying the mug it's a nice big mug that uh, suits my needs and you know pack a lot of coffee I love coffee alright and finally you know uh, book depository affiliate link if you're looking to buy a book uh, consider using my link. Of course, do a price check first. Make sure that is the best price you can get. And if it is, consider using my link. If you use my link, basically what happens is I get a small commission without any extra cost to you. Whether you use my link or not, you pay the same amount, basically. Right, and that is it for today's episode. Subscribe to the channel if you have not yet. Like the video if you liked. And ding the notification bell if you would like to get notifications. With that, I bid you guys adios and ciao.